Hi everyone, welcome to Jargon Free Help. I'm sure, like many of you, there are times I want to explain to someone how to use something on my iPhone or iPad. And a really good way to do that would be to record what's going on on the screen. And you can do that. There's a built-in screen recorder and you can also record the audio at the same time. You can actually switch that on or off. So perhaps you want to show someone how to use a particular app, how to do something, this is the way to do it. So let's just take a look at how that's done. I've got my iPhone here and let's just have a quick look at how this is done. So what you need to do whether you're using the iPhone or the iPad is swipe down from the top right where you can then see your control panel and it's this one here with the circle with the dot inside is the screen recorder. Now if you haven't got that what you need to do is switch it on. So what you need to do is just swipe up or press the home button depending on your iPhone. Tap on settings, go to the control center and customize controls. Now you'll see here I've got screen recording. There's a minus sign here in that circle and I could delete it if I wanted to or I can move it around by clicking on these three lines here. I'm going to keep them on the side there but further down are ones that I don't have on the control center and I can add them in and this applies to anything that happens to be available here. So I might want to add the alarm for example. So that's going to go down at the bottom there. So that's what you need to do if it's not there. So what you need to do is swipe down from the top, top right. Now if I just tap on that what's going to happen is it's just going to start recording without the audio necessarily. So what you need to do is tap and hold. You'll see it says start recording. I can choose what it is that I want to record. It's got microphone off here. What I need to do is I'm just going to switch that on. I tap it. You can now see it's on. When I start recording, I get a countdown. Three, two, one. It's now recording. I tap. Now what I'm going to do is let's say I want to show someone how to use Lightroom on my iPhone or iPad. So what I'm going to do is go to Lightroom here. I've got some pictures of no surprise. They're cats and I want to say share that one and I would tap at the top here, choose share to and then show exactly what I would have to do next. But I think you get the idea here. You'll notice at the top in red it's telling me the time there. That actually indicates not the length of the recording but actually the time itself but it's telling me that I'm recording because of the color. So to stop the recording I just tap on that. It asks me if I want to stop the screen recording. I'm going to say stop. That has now, you'll see at the top the screen recording was saved video saved to photos. If I tap on that it comes up here in my photos and if I want to I can just go to my photos and if I was just back here you'd see it was my recording down here. Now before I share that I probably want to edit it so I'm just going to tap on it. I'm going to tap on edit because I don't want this whole beginning bit and I can just drag this arrow across here. It's probably around about there and I probably don't want the ending as well which has got that same so I can choose it. I can then play to see if that's right or not. Let's turn up the volume. On my iPhone okay, that, I'm going to say that that's okay. You could fiddle around with this. I'm going to say done. I'm going to save as a new video clip. If I don't want to keep the old one I could just do save video and it overwrites it but I quite like the idea of keeping the original just in case. Let's hit save video there. It's done. I can now share it in the usual way. So I can just tap on my share button down here and I could choose who I want to send that to. So that is how you can record a video on your iPhone or iPad and then be able to share that with somebody. This is a great tool, particularly if you're working from home these days and you need to share something, this is the way to do it. If you want to know more, and I've got lots of videos on there, iPhone, Excel, Word, PowerPoint, iPhone, iPad, even photography and video, Please subscribe to the channel. If you like this video, please click on the like. And I hope to see you again soon. Stay safe. Thanks for watching.